Hi, my name is Israel Silverstein. I've been in this yeshiva for three years, and I really think I gained a lot. My name is Mandy Holtzman. I'm in the Bible Yeshiva all my life. I'm, it's my second year in Masifta. Wonderful experience. My name is Avram Tov Chekov, and I'm, uh, I guess you would call it a recent graduate. Lubavitch Yeshiva provides a unique experience for the Bachem. Lubavitch Yeshiva has given me the foundation to become an emissary of the Rebbe, Shlia. It's given me the tools to actually go out one day and share all of this knowledge with others. outside individual is the um, uniqueness of the way the school is set up, with the smaller classes and the individuality that the Rebbe's are able to give to the students. Today more than ever it seems that that is going to be one of the key factors in the success of our children. Our yeshiva is at the moment, let's call it modest, it's relatively small. A larger yeshiva has a greater energy. But our little yeshiva remarkably has quite an energy and it has a magical cohesion. The Anola members are teaching from the heart. They are giving the heart and they understand every single word. They want them to be happy in the time when he is in yeshiva. There is an unusual loyalty to the Babish yeshiva. The boys who spent even a short time with the yeshiva go on to other places will always affectionately refer to themselves as the Chayvave boys. There's a certain sense of belonging, which it's difficult to attribute to any individual or individuals. Where does that energy come from? It's just, it's just the energy, it's just the spirit, it's just the environment in the school. But I know for sure no one's doing it. I'm not quite a list. Yeah, in other words, it's saying not and and I forgot the Isha in the time to appear in the video. Call me again. Yes, whether it's she's commanded in Islam, it's a mitzvah, and she, and she has the mitzvah of no field. The Rebbe was always so dynamic in each, each person that passed by him, the individual feeling that each one has. And that's the feeling that I got when I was in, in the yeshiva. Um, the fact that each child or each student feels he himself is important. And not that he's just amongst a group lost in like, like, you know, a small pine tree, and lost in a big massive forest. Each one is a large tree. And that's important. Yeshiva does not try to make a mold that everyone has to fit into the mold, but rather the individual is worked with to develop their individual talents and their character. Our yeshiva, they receive a very balanced education, uh, both in, in the Iyun, delving into the Talmud at a very deep level, and also covering a lot of ground. We receive a share from Rabbi Jacobson around three times a week. Um, it's really remarkable how he takes these Hasidic mystical concepts and relates them to everyday life. I've grown tremendously from this year. And we often have guest lecturers, Rashi Yeshiva from throughout the world who are visiting Kran Heights or visiting 770, and they are invited to our Yeshiva uh, to lecture, and they're always uh, impressed by the knowledge and the background of our students. It's not only the time when they are required to learn, but we see what they do in their free time to have group learning and uh, the one student caring for another and helping a weaker student. Not the end of the year, but we know that we're going to come to the real place in Eretz Yisrael. Today is the 
8th of Nissan, three days before the Lubavitch Rebbe's 100th birthday. And to celebrate this, we've sent out 100 mitzvah tanks out there in the in New York City streets. We're going to be handing out matzah. We're going to be handing out Pesach literature, all to get Jewish people to increase in uh, mitzvahs and all people to increase, increase in acts of goodness and kindness. Happy birthday to the Lubavitch Rebbe. Every Sunday, the Bachman go to a German Flatbush where they have sports activities, whether it's swimming or basketball. They come back refreshed, Bachman ready to tackle another week of learning. So as a parent, I really appreciated that they took the boys out once a week to the gym and where they could play ball and swim and really let their energy out in a positive way. Uh, recently, you should have started construction on a basement which will be here to Hashem host in the kitchen which will bring you revenue for the yeshiva. And Minsky, at the same time as being the Nala Ruchli, who cares about every single bacher, also was making sure that the building was going up. But he made sure that everything was done in the most economical way and the sturdiest way possible. Our yeshiva at 885 Eastern Parkway is its own financial entity. We don't receive any funding from any um, umbrella organizations. There are tremendous blessings found in the letters of the Rebbe for those who participate and who partner with the Lubavitch Yeshiva. The school doesn't carry the name of the students of the Yeshiva, it carries the name of its supporters. Taimche Tmimim means the supporters of the Tmimim. Meaning to say that those who support Taira are actually, on a higher level, are benefiting more spiritually, personally, from the Taira they're supporting than those whom they're actually supporting. We all should stop for a moment and think how do we give back to your yeshiva? The way you give back is not just to say, I thank you. Karasatobin, you have to give back in a physical way. It shouldn't be understated how wonderful, how great an opportunity it is for somebody to, to support Taita. The schus for themselves and for their children. It's, it's, a, it's a great schooler for being blessed with nachas and gesund, uh, and all good things. But Rav Ochel believed in the Sifta, Yitzios in the Sifta is not the same way as he came to the Sifta. As we can say it in the same way the Rebbe used to bench every uh, Mitzvah Bochel. They should grow up to be a Chosim Yerushalayim in Alamdi. So Rav Ochel in the Sifta is the Bochel, which should be a Chosim in Yerushalayim, a Chosim Shanochis, and Alamdi. Alamdi means to prepare them for the years of Mesa Mendesh. investment in our yeshiva is not only an investment in one bacher, it's an investment in the future of the Yiddishkeit. Most of our Talmudian, most of our students are going to go out to the Shluchim of the Rebbe in different cities and countries throughout the world. Each one will touch the hearts of tens, hundreds, thousands of other Yiddin. And by their learning in our yeshiva and your support of that learning, they will be able to influence thousands of other Yidin to make the world a better place.